What's up, man? 25 gamers. In today's video, we're gonna be focusing on our, our uh, X Factor Slash. Our blitz beating formation comes from the Minnesota uh, Gun Empty Bunch, as you probably all thought it would come from. Um, and basically, we're just gonna show you how to run this. This is a very effective formation for what we can do with it. A lot of things we could do with it. Remember, we like to come into it flipped. Um, the audibles we like to set really quick. Um, this is why I said Minnesota's playbook almost has to have custom audibles. The audibles we like to set for the Gun Empty Bunch. Um, we like to put, we like to leave that play action mountain read. Uh, we like to put the Vikes uh, trail in there, and we like to put the um, divide wheel in there. And then also, if you wanted to, you could put a Z spot. Uh, depending on what you like to do, you could put a Z spot or, or Vikes trail in there. It doesn't really matter to me. Um, they both are ran, you know, decently. But for this video, we're gonna break down Vikes trail and divide wheel and PA mountain read. So we're gonna come into this formation flipped. And we'll show you the reason why we like to do that. So we're coming out in the empty bunch just just to save some time here. But coming out in a flipped here, and the base, uh, the main play I want to focus on is divide wheel. Uh, we'll just come out in some kind of quarter D cover four. Um, real quick, um, one thing you have on this is this read option, and this is one of the most effective things out of this formation because it's it's a read option out of a five wide receiver formation. So it's like. Yes, there is auto motion, so they can kind of, they can kind of get you on the timing. This is one of those plays that you just want to kind of throw in every now and then, um, just to let them know that you can run the ball out of this, and it's going to really make them honor it. And again, the idea here at quarters is doing a great job of stopping it, but the idea is you're just running the ball out of a five wide. That's really all we're doing here, but it's very effective. Um, especially in this game because of how good the read option is. Eventually what will happen is they'll try to get aggressive, play the running back, and then use the quarterback. If that happens, guys, it's going to be very difficult to stop this play because when you get the ball to the quarterback, you have all those lead blockers on that side. So that leads me into my next play, PA Mountain Read. Uh, what we like to do here is I like to put Sidney Rice on an underneath drag route, and then I'll just run them auto motion here, and then I will cancel the play action immediately. Main read here is those underneath meshing m mesh routes. Also, you guys have a corner route if you guys like that. I like corner routes sometimes, not all day, but you know, in certain situations they are effective. Here you see the corner route is going to beat the cover three to the outside there. So that's how we like to run those two plays in combination with one another. Really, nothing else. Uh, real quick, I do want to show you two man under though. What happens on two man under in this? Um, that route's going to uh, Harvin's route's going to kill man. And then also, um, if I remember correctly, Golden Tate's route should beat man as well. Uh, with the when he lights up right there, little double move, and then you get to the inside there. So that's that. Um, Bikes trails. The next play I want to break down. Uh, Golden Tate smoke screen him obviously, and we're gonna motion Sydney Rice all the way out here. And we're gonna snap right about there, and the first read is always gonna be this little drag route to Miller. Um, the second read is going to be the um, trail route to Lynch. A lot of times that will be open against any zone or man. It just kind of sits in a pocket. And if they're going to cover three... Um, whoops, wrong play. Wrong play, daggone it. If they are going to cover three here, uh, Sidney Rice will get wide open. As you see right there and you're just going to click on and user catch that right underneath those safeties now if they're in two man under which a lot of people like to run this year uh, let me get into the trail motion Sydney Rice out he's going to be able to be in a read against two man under as well no no and then you throw Sydney Rice right there and just user catch that and then the last read here that I wanted to show you guys and this applies to both zone and man as late reads is this um, deep corner route to Harvin no no and then you just look you got the corner out okay so that's that play pretty simple just wanted to show you the progressions and then the last play is the divide wheel this is the main play we call out of this uh, what I like to do here is I like to put Golden Tate on a 10 yard in route I like to put Sidney Rice on a drag and we're going to motion snap Sidney Rice three steps to the left to try to get that nice separation against man so, three steps, and he's our first read, of course. And you see he's going to have that really nice separation against man-to-man -man coverage. Next read is going to be the halfback on this play. Uh, it's a pretty easy, simple transition. 
So if we see that Sydney Rice for some reason is not covered, or un, un, excuse me, let me rephrase that. If for some reason we see that Sydney Rice is covered, um, then we're going to check back into the halfback here and see if we can hit him. Um, almost like a snap throw. It's just almost like a it's almost like a pick play for each other. And you see you pass lead him to the ball to the left. It's going to be wide open. All right, uh, next play, our next read, rather, is the route to Harvin, his wheel route. You see it gets good separation. That was cover four there. Um, we'll show you it against man. Against man, you'll have to use or catch it. Um, whoops. Against, well, actually, you don't have to use or catch it against man, I don't think. If I remember correctly. Let me see. Yeah, you don't have to use or catch it. He'll just do it his own, so, so that's nice. And then... Um, Next read is Miller coming across the middle. So motion him out. Miller comes across the middle. Pass lead down into the inside. And you see he's going to get a nice separation there. Not the best against uh, man. More or less a zone read. Uh, we like to have that underneath uh, levels. Basically we have levels against zone. Um, and you're going to see there that he's going to get good space. Gets cover three. And then the last read is mainly for it's a curl route combination. So if they're in cover three or cover two, uh, this in route right there will be open to Golden Tate. You want to pass lead it up. Uh, at least that's what I like to do. Um, there I pass lead it in, and you saw it wasn't effective. If you just pass lead it up, a lot of times he'll get, he'll just sit right there, and they won't hit stick him out of the ball. And then a late, late read if they are in maximum, max, maximum, maximum coverage defense. So cover three here, something like this. Max coverage, all out coverage D. Harvin's route will be a nice user catch option. You know? And you just try to user catch that against man. Um, so that's really what we do here um, out of this formation. Just a lot of divide wheel. I really like this read option. Um, a lot of people really like this read option. But a very balanced formation here from the gun empty bunch. And again, if they're blitzing you, so real quick. There's a blitz off that edge. If they are blitzing you, and they probably will eventually to try to stop you somehow. Well, Sydney Rice is a quick read. And so you see if they if they don't have any middle coverage, Sydney Rice will be there. If they have heavy middle coverage, so something like a cover three, two yellows over the middle, something like this, and just a, st a standard zone blitz. They're worried about the wheel route to Harvin, so they're going to leave the purple out there. Well, then you're going to be very easy. You're going to be able to hit Marshawn Lynch here. Rice is not open, but you see the pick, and then Lynch is going to be wide open. And then you're running and running and running and running and running. Real quick, uh, I'll be show you cover two sink. I haven't showed you that yet. Uh, cover two sink, basically everything's going to be the same. Uh, Rice will still be open, which is nice. Um, also... Uh, about those wheel routes, I really just want to show you the wheels against cover two sink. So first we'll show you the Lynch route. Um, his route will still get pretty decent, uh, decently open. Problem is he does risk um, maybe a drop, but still kind of open. And then you have your boy uh, Harvin. Whoops, apologize for that. This controller's been kind of acting up. But you have Harvin. You still have him against cover two sink. Pass lead him to the right. Wide open. So, anyways, guys, that's a good empty bunch. Thanks for watching this week. Appreciate it. Hope you guys enjoy the gameplay. Leave me your feedback. Let me know what I can do to improve my commentary. Also, let me know what I can do to improve my schemes and tips and what you guys really need me to, to start focusing on. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check out that defensive scheme. And also, be sure to check out this full gameplay to see how this offense and defense works in a full live game. Thanks for watching this week. Be sure to subscribe for more tips. And we'll see you guys tomorrow.